FAT04 Fiber Arrangement Tool is designed to arrange 250 micron coated fibers and make a temporary ribbon configuration so that the fibers may be mass fusion spliced using the same procedures as conventional ribbon fiber. Any number of fibers which are applicable to mass fusion splicing may be arranged and ribbonized. In this video, we'll review the Fujikora FAT04 operation, maintenance, and cleaning processes. Many of the fiber arrangement tool's components are intuitive, so you will not need extensive training to learn how to operate the FAT04. However, identifying key components will help in understanding this demonstration. Let's start with the fiber arrangement base. Arrangement cover. Arrangement shim. Adhesive applicator base. Slide arm. Adhesive applicator block. Clip. Sponge pad. And adhesive. Included and optional items are shown in Table 2 and Table 3, respectively. Ensure that the fibers are clean and free of any debris or cable gel. Identify the fiber numerical sequence by utilizing the color code before placing the fibers in the FAT04. Place the fibers one by one into the slit between the fiber arrangement base and the clear plastic arrangement cover in the correct color code order. Place the fibers such that the fiber ends extend just beyond the adhesive applicator block, as shown. After loading the fibers into the fiber arrangement base, insert the arrangement shim in the slot between the fiber arrangement base and the arrangement cover, and push gently until the fibers are in contact with each other. Open the adhesive applicator block cover and secure a sponge pad to it. Move the slide arm to position the applicator block against the fiber arrangement block. Depress the fiber arrangement base to the lower position. The fibers are now arranged and should be lying in the channel in the adhesive applicator block. Smooth out the fibers and while holding them in a parallel ribbon form, apply gentle tension. While applying tension, deposit FAA03 ribbon forming adhesive into the reservoir in the adhesive applicator block. The fibers should be arranged correctly at this time. Close the cover of the adhesive applicator. To apply adhesive over the length of fibers to be ribbonized, slowly slide the slide arm until it stops. Do not disturb the fibers for at least 30 seconds to allow the adhesive to dry. After the adhesive dries, secure the ribbonized fibers with the clip as they exit the arrangement base. Trim the fibers close to the inside of the adhesive applicator block. Raise the arrangement base to the upper position and remove the arrangement shim. Remove the ribbonized fiber. Reference the Fusion Splicer Instruction Manual for splicing procedures. When debris or adhesive remain in the adhesive applicator, fibers may not be arranged properly when ribbonized. Clean the adhesive applicator block thoroughly with a cotton swab and alcohol. If debris is present in the fiber arrangement base, fibers may not be arranged properly when ribbonized. Remove the arrangement cover by loosening the thumb screw. Clean the fiber arrangement base and the arrangement cover with a tissue or cotton swab and alcohol. Reattach the arrangement cover and tighten the thumb screw while pushing the cover against the edge of the fiber arrangement base. 